Now, to tell their side of the story, let's welcome Jim and Tammy Baker. Well, thank you, church lady. It was kind of you to invite us here. You had preached that God wanted his subjects to live a, a lavish or successful lifestyle. You quoted from the New Testament, I pray you will be in good health as your soul prospers. I really felt that prosperity gospel was the truth. Renew your pledge in the name of the Lord. But questions were being raised about what all these pledges were paying for. In 1978, the Charlotte Observer started publishing articles about the misuse of PTL funds. It sparked a five-year-long FCC investigation. There were problems at home, too. Tammy Faye was rumored to be having an affair with the man who produced her record albums, Gary Paxton. And Jim was worried that Tammy would leave him. But he had an idea. What if he got Tammy jealous? Can you really even remember it? Not too much. Baker would never see Jessica Hahn in person again. But those 15 minutes would destroy his life because it wouldn't be long before Jessica Hahn revealed Jim Baker's secret. I am shocked, shocked. Well, not that shocked. Now, Jim Baker's back on TV. If the power goes out, we believe in being ready for anything. I guess you'd say, Jim and Lori, help me be prepared today. Once again, spreading his faith alongside wife Lori. He's back on TV talking about salvation and Jesus and selling a lot of stuff. Now, actress Kristen Chenowitz, who says she grew up watching the Bakers, as all of us did on TV, is now developing a musical based on Tammy Faye. That's something I'd go see. Yeah, this is a big, <laughs> this is a big scandal. I, yeah. I remember this to this. Yep. To oh, the yeah. Remember yeah. the mascara? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Welcome to the Jim Baker Show. Here are your hosts, Jim and Lori Baker. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Gray Street. Hi there. The man who discovered the blood moons is here with us. Yes, Mark he Bill is. is yes. back home. Thank you yes. for coming back. Thank so you. great to have you back, Mark. One thing, I don't know how many of you realize it. I think most of you here do because your audience is pretty sharp. Oh, they are. But just like you celebrate your birthday every year wow, on your birthday, I love that. Yes. most people may not realize it, but this coming Monday wow. is the very day Adam opened up his eyes for the first time. Wow. That's the anniversary That's of the creation of the world. Wow. Ten days later is Yom Kippur, the day of judgment. In a few hours, there's going to be an event take place. And you won't get food for six months to a year. We will be right back after this special message. Alrighty, Dave writes, in the church age, how do we distinguish between true prophets and the false ones, between genuine exorcism ministries and the frauds? plus a bonus of six additional buckets for a total of 28 buckets. I want to show you something. All this food is for a gift of $2,500. Eight years of bulk food. This is the. This is what you should be doing. Wow. John, you come up. Uh, you're, you're the rice preacher. You told me to do this. We got, Look, at they got shovels. By the way, get a shovel. These are foldable shovels. It, it'll go in your backpack. <laughs> this is how you dig the latrine. Shut up and take my money. Listen to me. 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 God is meaning business. Yes. And I will die on this stage if I have to. Something so major is going to begin to happen. And you're going to lose everything. <laughs> I was dying. 